Hello, hi everyone. In this video, I am going to show you that how you can dual boot your MI laptop with Windows and Ubuntu. I am also going to show you what problem I faced when I was trying to dual boot my laptop. Recently, I bought a new laptop which has 256 GB storage with original Windows 10 support, but I also want to run Ubuntu on it. So let's get started. Installing Chrome on a system. Now I am going to download Ubuntu from its official site. So here my ISO file. Install Rufus which is used for making bootable pen drive from an ISO file. Connect your pen drive and format it. ISO file is downloading. Let's create some free space. Go to create and format hard disk partition and shrink your volume. But it did not give me as much space as I needed, just 42 GB. But I wanted around 100 GB. Let's find the solution with the help of a software. Download this software. Install it and run this software. Select your disk and resize or move your disk but this software will not work we will create free space at the time of installation of ubuntu so for now run the rufos and select your ISO file start yes okay okay power of your computer Power on, after that press F12. Select bootable drive, Ubuntu. Wait, let me adjust the camera. Let me adjust the camera. Continue. Installation third party software for graphics. And click continue. You can select installation alongside Windows, but I need more privileges, so I select something else. Here, you can see my free space which I created earlier. But I want to increase this space further. But here I deleted my original windows. Now you can make as much space as you want for Ubuntu. So I make free space for swap area.
and for root folder as you can see on your screen select root folder and windows boot manager for bootloader installation install now continue kolkata install it please remove the installation medium then press enter as you can see my windows did not load when i selected so i adopt all the steps tips for fix this but i could not fix it so i decided that i will install windows again here i am showing you how you make bootable pen drive from ubuntu just download the iso file from its official site connect your pen drive and open the disk tool restore disk image and select your iso file here start restoring restore password My ISO file is ready. Look at his eyes. Connect your pen drive and power on the system. After that press F12. Select Windows Boot Manager. select free space do i even have to tell all this now as you can see my windows is working fine Can you see the error? Window is asking for BitLocker recovery key, and I do not have the recovery key. So let's find it. I tried a lot, then I got the solution. Tried a lot. Power on. After that, press F12. and select windows boot manager windows okay then go to the system and security then device encryption print your recovery key save it in pdf format 
and note it down. This is my recovery key. Shut down. Enter your recovery key here. This is my recovery key. And press enter to continue. As you can see my windows is working fine. Let's check for the Ubuntu. But another error comes here. My bootloader is not working. Now I'm fixing this bootloader error using EZBCD tool. But EZBCD tool does not work for EFI mode. As you can see Ubuntu is not getting started. So now how do I access my Ubuntu? For that go to the setting in update and security select recovery mode and then select restart now. choose user device Ubuntu as you can see system is loading open your terminal and for fixing bootloader just copy these commands and run on the terminal The commands which I have given in the description below. Select recommended repair. Boot successfully repaired. Power off. As you can see, the bootloader is working fine. Oh, check for the Ubuntu. Power off. Shut down. Both OS are booting fine. 